Hi guys, today we're going to read Thanksgiving Day Thanks. And guys, I hope you subscribe to my channel and add a thumbs up. Thanks. Thanksgiving is coming, said Sam's teacher, Miss Wraith. What one special thing about the holiday would you give thanks for? Football, shouted Nicole. Sweet potatoes with marshmallows, Jeffrey yelled. Shopping, announced Tiffany. Sam wasn't sure what his one special thing would be. Who knows the story of the very first Thanksgiving, asked Miss Wright. Sam's best friend, Mary Ann, knew the, when the pilgrims came to America, Native Americans showed them how to plant corn and hunt for food. So the pilgrims invited the Native Americans to a biggest feast to celebrate their friendship and their first harvest. That's right, said Miss Wright. How should we celebrate Thanksgiving in class? We can have our own feast. J Jeff, Jeffrey, success. We can dress up like pilgrims and Native Americans, said Mary Ann. Oh, goody, Tiffany clapped her hands. Costumes, Sam didn't have any idea. He was stuck on figuring out what he was thankful for. Winston's hand shoot up. My grandma makes a turkey out of yarn for Thanksgiving. Ew, squirreled Tiffany. You eat yarn turkey? Ew, squeaked her friends. No, it's a decoration, Winston said. Before dinner, we write what we are thankful for on a paper feather and stick it on stick it in the turkey that is that that's a great tradition said miss wright everyone picked one thing you are really thankful for to write on a feather and i don't mean candy she added with a smile uh-oh thought sam The class came up with all sorts of Thanksgiving projects. Jeffrey organized a pumpkin pie making contests. Nicole made special mats. She collected red and orange maple leaves and pressed them between two sheets of wax paper. While shopping, for a pilgrim outfit, Tiffany learned about a Thanksgiving food drive for the needy and donate cans of soup. Weston built a minute Mayflower, just like the pilgrim ship from Popsicle Sticks. Mary Ann made a headband out of white and purple beads to look like a Wampanoag of the Wampanoag trib. She also practiced with a bow and arrow until each arrow rubs six sextian her sextian head. Stuck to the Targus build's eye. Meanwhile, Sam worried. Winky school? Mary Ann tried to cheer him up. That's how the Wampanoag said good day. Say good day. Usually, Sam liked to learn the big words Mary Ann used. 
but not this time. There's nothing good about it. I still haven't figured out my project. Sam sight, sight, or what I am thankful for. Think about what you enjoy the most on Thanksgiving Day, Marianne. Success. Sam thought and thought. The day of the feast arrived. Table were hepped with food and autumn decorations. Jeffrey had dressed up as governor. Pradford, Tiffany, Wes, Priscilla from Longfellow's poem about pilgrims. Marianne was Squanto. Where's your project? Marianne asked Sam. It's outside. It's a surprise. The class lined up to write their, their thanks on the paper, Turkey Feather. Jeffrey was think, thankful for turkey stuffing. Weston was thankful for school janitor. Began so nice about the floating, flooding the cafeteria when testing his Mayflower. Mary Ann was thankful for books. It was almost Sam's turn. All of a sudden, a huge gust, gust of wind rattled on the classroom window. A storm was coming. Oh no, Sam cried, my project. Sam dashed outside a tree to unit, unite his surprise. A branch of air motors, balloons he fought his way back through the window toward the classroom, sticking close to the school building. Everyone darted to the window just in time to see a big dog bubbling, bobbing by. Then a cat popped up and a turkey and a frog it was just like Thanksgiving Day par parade on TV. Another blast of wind wiped the balloons. The frog popped. The turkey broke loose. The cat flew away. Oh dear, said Miss Wright. Mary Ann grabbed her bow and arrows and and the yarn turkey. She raced outside. Sam was chasing the dog. It string ju just out of his reach. Mary Ann tried the tied turkey yarn to an arrow. She took aim, zing, the arrow Barber, bubber cup stuck on the dog's nose. Mary Ann reeled in. Yay, cheered the students. But Sam was sad. He can't have a parade with only one balloon, he said. And I still don't know what I'm, I'm going to write on my feather. Mary Ann thought for a minute. Your parade was a great idea. Sam, is there something about a big Thanksgiving day you're thankful for? Well, my whole family watches it together. We drink hot chocolate and we tell stories. Grandpa talks about going to New York City for the parade. When he was a little, when he was little, we laughed a lot. Sam smiled. Now he knew what to pull on his feather. I am thankful for time with my family. Later, Sam wrote another feather and the chunk it on Mary's, Mary Ann's headband. I am thankful for best friends. Now I'm going to read this whole thing. I might, um, 
I might not know some words, but you guys might want to read the whole story too. So, you can always pause the video and read the story too. A note about Thanksgiving, seeking a better life. In the new world, the pilgrims braved a stormy Atlantic Ocean and the tiny Mayflower. Its pride was just a little bigger that than tennis courts. One, once they landed in what is now Massachusetts, the pilgrims faced many hardships. They probably would not have survived without that help of the Wampanoag tribe. And Squando, a Pawtuxed Native Americans who had learned English while a Squaton thought the pilgrims to grow corn, beans, squash, vegetables. The Native American called the three sisters. He showed them how to tab maple trees for syrup and where to to gather selfish sucks. Um such in sixteen twenty one grateful they had food for the winter. Governor Wilman Bradford called for the day of Thanksgiving. Such celebra um, celebrations were a harvest tradition in England. He invited the Wampanoag. Um, the feast was very different from today. All through wild turkey was probably on the menu along with the eel and swan meat, pumpkin pies, cranberry sauce, and sweet potatoes definitely were not in. Instead, the pilgrims might have enjoyed suckle trash, a stew of corn and lima beans or pemmican crushed corn berries and dried deer meat in metal metad fat. Thank you guys for watching my channel and I hope you subscribed and add a thumbs up to my channel. Bye!